Hello and welcome to your real estate market update for Greeley, Colorado. It is now January 2024. We're really excited about the 2024 real estate market, but to see what's really going on in the beginning of this year, we've got to look back at last year. So I've got all the data from December 2023 in Greeley. So this is your real estate market update. We're going to take a look at that. My name is Andy Hawbaker. I'm with Colwell Banker Realty, Northern Colorado. Okay, the first one we've got up here is new listings. There were 65 new listings in December of 2023. That's down 3% from the previous year. You know, it's going to be slow at the end of the year, so this isn't too surprising here. There were 79 closed sales during the month of December 2023. That's down 17.7%. So the number of transactions is down quite a bit from one year ago. But the average days on the market was 71, which is 1.4% up from last year. So again, homes are sitting on the market a little bit longer. Market's a little bit slower, but again, it was the end of the year. The median sales price was $430,000. That's actually up almost 6% from last year. So prices haven't fallen. Even those first slides showed we were slower, prices haven't come down. Um, in fact, people are paying 96.8% of the asking price in December of 2023. So still, you know, not having these huge drops in home prices. The average square foot price was $192. That's actually up a half a percent from the previous year. So as you can see, the number of transactions are slowing down, but that doesn't mean that the prices are coming down. A lot of people thought there was going to be home price drops in 2023. Uh, we definitely didn't see that happen. Home prices stayed pretty steady. It's not, in many cases, went up a little bit. Um, and we got some great news at the end of December of 2023 that the uh, interest rates um, are dropping. So in like October of 2023, interest rates hit almost 8%, 8.1%. And we dropped all the way down to about six and a half, six point six, somewhere in that range for the last couple of weeks of December. So that got us a spark that we were hoping for. Um, a home affordability increases as the rates come down. That can actually save you hundreds of dollars on your mortgage payment. Um, however, what a lot of people aren't thinking about is that as home prices come down prices go up because of competition, there's more people in the market. So everyone wants to buy when the prices, um, excuse me, everyone wants to buy when the rates are low. Uh, so that brings more people to the market. There's people who haven't bought in the last two years because um, inflation, uh, the costs of homes, and then the high interest rates, all those things made it really hard for people to purchase. So they want to buy homes. They haven't been able to for a few years. Now affordability is going to be better with the lower rates. So more people are going to be in the market, but what's that going to do? Sadly, that's going to make home prices go up, make it still hard to purchase a home. But if you talk to me, I'd be happy to walk you through first time home buyer, all those kind of things of how, how you can, uh, put less money down, you know, find, find the best deals out there. Reach out to me directly at my website and I'm happy to uh, talk you through those things. Now, if you're a home seller, uh, my, my believe that now is going to be a great time to put your home on the market. I think the spring is going to be crazy. Uh, like I said, demand is increasing. So there's going to be more people in the market. Be a great time to sell your home if and still get an okay deal on the next house if you're living locally if you're moving out of the area um, then that doesn't really matter <laughs> but um, i do think home prices are going to go up i do think this spring i think if you hit the market in february or march uh, homes will sell pretty quickly a couple of the downsides that we showed were the number of days on market 71 days on market in Greeley. That's really um, about 30 days for a normal transaction to close. So that means if 30 days was just an under contract period, that means it probably took four weeks, 40 days to go under contract on average. So that is a little bit longer than we've seen over the last few years, but it's still actually pretty normal. It's a normal market. So that is what's going on in Greeley, Colorado. It is January 2024. I'm really excited about this year. I think there's going to be a lot of great opportunities for both home buyers and especially home sellers. If there's anything I could do to help you out, I'd be happy to do that. My name is Andy Hawbaker. I'm a realtor with Coldwell Banker in Northern Colorado. I service Greeley and all things Northern Colorado. You can always hit me up at my website, which is andyhawbaker.com. Let me know how I can help. Thanks.